Hi there, Internet. Uh, today I'm going to demonstrate a new minecart station that I made using the new tracks with the powered rails and the detector rails. Uh, so, just to demonstrate real quick, push the button, wait a few seconds, cart comes along, stops for a moment, kicks along, and if nobody's in it, it turns around and goes back downstairs, where all the carts are. Uh, if you've seen my other video, um, it has a, the setup is that there's a series of docks downstairs, I call them docks, docking bays, dock stations, whatever, uh, where there are some carts waiting. Um, so it can hold up to, right now it can hold up to four carts. Uh, so if a cart comes along and nobody sits in it and it goes to that point, it goes downstairs and goes into the first available dock. If there's no docks available, uh, the cart gets kicked back out and goes down the path to uh, the next station, assuming there's another station, until it finally finds an empty spot. Uh, or just keeps going around and around and around. Anyway, um, so to do a bit more demonstration here, this time if I actually get in the cart, and it only pauses for a moment, um, it doesn't usually mess up like that, but anyway, now it goes down the path instead. And uh, while I'm talking, and while it's going down here, I'm going to talk a bit. Um, I'm going to put this uh, world map on in the description, assuming I remember to. Uh, so if you want to check it out for yourself, uh, just come along and download it, load it up on your own uh, server or uh, system or whatever. Um, finding it might be a little hard because it's a bit of a distance from the spawn point, but it's... Uh, like, if you just, <laughs> I mean, if you just walk east or whatever direction it is, um, toward land, because you'll start in a little desert area anyway, blah, 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 keep walking that way, eventually you see this big giant uh, desert mountain here, um, and then from there you just make it to the station. Anyway, uh, come on up here, I'm going to hop out, a little too early, the cart will go along, and head back down. Okay. Now to show you what's actually down there, uh, if you go this way, oh, I can't go this way, anyway, um, for whatever reason, if it gets kicked down, there's a little, there's a little booster under here, this is actually an idea I was quite proud of, um, it just goes in a circle, and it stops unless that pad is pressed, but anyway, so we go down here, um, this is, if a cart's returning, it comes down this path, comes around, and here it comes to the sorting area. Um, each of these intersections here, uh, this one included, um, if, these are the four docks, one, two, three, and four, if one of these docks is empty, um, the path will change so that it will go down there. So you see right now, the cart will go down there. Um, now if we put a cart down there, let me see if I got one. I do not. So, da, 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 da. If I put a cart down there. You notice that track right there changed. This track right here changed. So now, if a cart comes along, it'll pass over that. And if it passes over all four of these, then it gets shot back up, and like I said, it goes on to the next station. Um, now, the actual docking area here. Uh, oof. Um, each one goes down a ramp if it gets selected and gets shot up out and goes to the area you saw before. Um, what pushes it is a booster track, booster cart comes along and again this whole, in each of these intersections is wired up to one of these docks which each one has a detector rail on it. And finally down here, um, ignore that, uh, after after the booster cart boosts one of these, it comes back, comes around, and then stops here because this track isn't powered so it doesn't push through. Um, now if it gets powered, you'll see, I'll show you what happens here. If I can get up there. I have this little demonstration button here. This will send the signal the same way the button upstairs will do, which is what this is connected to. So, hit the button, cart goes along, pushes the first available one, goes up there, and if we wait, eventually it will come back down. So, give it a second. Da, 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 da. There it comes. 
and poof, right back there. So that's how it works. Um, if you have any questions, well, I don't know if I can explain it well, but like I said, the the uh, world map will be available, and you can look it up and see for yourself. And if you still don't get something, uh, leave a comment or send me a uh, private message or what have you, and I'll do my best to explain it, but I can't promise anything. Um, in the works that I need, still need to set up with this one, which has, which my earlier video has, is an indicator light, which uh, will indicate when one of those four, uh, when if any of those four are filled with a minecart. If all the, if all the uh, docks are empty, then the light would be off. Um, I still need to implement that, but it shouldn't be too difficult. And uh, that's my track. So, um, yeah, uh, best of luck doing some more mining. This was kind of a bear, but it wasn't too hard to put together. And away I go. <laughs> Have fun.